My name's Nicholas McCarthy. I am a concert pianist and I'm a motivational speaker, but I've got a slight difference. I was born without my right hand. I didn't have really any musical inclination when I was a child. I had no interest in music. My parents weren't musicians. I wasn't from a musical family. So really the first time that I discovered music and, and classical music was at the age of 14 when my friend, who was an accomplished pianist, she was playing in my school assembly a piece of Beethoven. Of course learning any instrument is hugely difficult and having one hand, of course, when you're wanting to learn the piano poses a completely different set of difficulties and really I would say the most difficult thing wasn't so much the learning of the piano because that's actually the, the part I found came quite naturally to me. Um, it was more getting the industry to sit up and listen. If talking about my career, the struggles that I've had there to do with my, with my disability has been people and industry people not welcoming me with the open arms that maybe people would expect. So, so that's probably been, been the biggest challenge as a, as a professional pianist to, to be able to, to go through that world and that landscape and trying to make people understand and think, well, actually, you know, there's, there's this huge repertoire there for me to play and it's, it's by great master composers and I've got one hand and they wrote for left hand alone so I'm the perfect fit for it. The reactions I get from, from when I perform, it, it's great and that's kind of why I, I love doing what I do. I get that, you know, that people are shocked and I, I like that, I like to shock people. Um, people often don't know what to expect. The most standout or memorable moment of my career, I mean it's difficult because I'm very lucky that I've I've had the career that I've had so far. When I graduated from the Royal College of Music in London um, and I then found out, funnily enough, after doing four years study, that actually I'd made history because I was the first ever one-handed pianist to graduate from the college's 130-year history. So that was a wonderful moment for me to, to find out. Time kind of does a weird thing for me when I'm on stage and when I'm performing. It kind of stands still and speeds up at the same time. It's the only way I can describe it and meeting people, meeting fans, meeting new friends, it's, it's really part of why I do what I do. Of course it takes hard work, of course it's not easy, but I truly believe that anything is possible. And, you know, I mean, I'm a one-armed pianist and, and that was what I wanted to do from the age of 14 and, and, I, and I did it. I'm so excited that I'm, I'm on tour through October, November um, with my, my new tour called My Piano Pilgrimage. It really is taken me on a pilgrimage when I'm learning this of a journey through time, through centuries, a journey through to different countries. And I wanted just to bring that all together in one tour. So I'm so excited to, to be meeting people and, and be able to, to share them, you know, what I think, my wonderful music uh, with, with, my, with my new friends.